guys, welcome to Family Fun Pack. Today's vlog is not a happy vlog in some ways because we're talking about Zach. Um, last week, Zach was at school and we got a call and of course, Matt gets the call. I'm at the orthodontist, I believe, with Alyssa at the same time. So I wasn't even there. And then Matt calls me and he says he got a call from the school. And I was like, oh no, like know. you don't really ever want to get a call from the school. You're just always worried like what happened? Like what did my kid do, you know? But this time they were telling Matt that Zach had been hurt at school. They told you that he'd hurt his foot and they were just letting him know. They were just like, you know, we're putting ice on it. Just so you know, he got hurt, he's fine, whatever. And then I'm still driving home. I'm almost home at this point. They called Matt back like 30 minutes, hour, whatever later. And they said, okay, you need to come get him. He's in a lot of pain. He's not going to be able to stay at school. And I was just like, oh my gosh. So I was almost already to the school. So I just went and got him. And then we made a doctor's appointment. Well, Zach hurt his foot. Yeah. It looks okay, but it is swollen and bruised. And he hurt it playing soccer at school. Yeah. What did he do? Well, I was running, and then there's like one layer of bricks around the tree. I was gonna quickly kick it before it hit the bricks, but I was too late, so I hit the bricks. Uh, he might need surgery, and we are really hoping that's not the case. We're gonna we're gonna find out here, but they said he might wear a boot for like a month, so we'll see. Yeah, we're gonna be out of soccer for quite some time, unfortunately. We'll do something where we can we can just talk on the phone and see how you're doing, and if you're having um. That pain still, then we want to get some new x rays. Okay. okay. Yeah. Okay, now go ahead and stand up, put your foot all the way in. Is your heel touching? Um, not quite. Okay. And now it is. Okay. Yeah, I would say here about in a medium for sure. I don't need it. Sew it all up. We're in the waiting room. Yeah. Over the next place. Surgery. Oh really? Okay. Well, you guys are all set. I will get the X-rays over. Zach did his X-ray. He says he thinks it could be good news. Yeah. And then I said, well, the other doctor told me I might need surgery. And he's like, oh, really? And then he seemed pretty shocked. And then he's like, I can't imagine you getting surgery on this. Is pretty small. I good. Think, good. Good. I think. Yeah. Maybe there's a small fracture or... Yeah, maybe. Or, or maybe I just hit it so hard and it's not a fracture, but it's just bruised. Maybe. And I stubbed it super hard. We're hoping for the best. We're going to find out later today, I think. Yeah. Well, I saw the x-ray and I doubt it's like a big break because I didn't see anything that looked a lot off. He saw the x-ray. Yeah, so maybe it's a little <laughs> fracture, but I don't think it's as bad as I thought it would be. I'm glad you're an expert yeah. x-ray reader. I'm a doctor now. <laughs> While we are at the soccer game, we have still not heard back from the doctor. Yeah. Zach got fitted for his boot today and it comes in tomorrow, so. I'm just trying to keep my foot straight so it could yes. start healing. And he is not playing at his game. And Owen is so sweetly <laughs> helping. Such yeah. a nice brother. You wanna play some punch with my oh, I don't think I he can. But we're just gonna watch the game yeah. and cheer for the team. This is the championship, so oh, yeah. we gotta win. Yeah, I Looks like Chris can. is gonna be playing goalie for a minute, huh? I have a really good plan. You have a good plan? Okay, what is it? <laughs> David and Aiden and Eli are other really good pairs. Yeah. They're all gonna go. Oh, you see those gloves? Striker. Okay, those they are cool gloves. Nice. Yeah. Here's Chris with the ball. So no fracture was found. No oh, fracture. Good. good. Okay. So what do you think it is? So it's so most likely he can still have like he can have a, a non-spice fracture, like a stress fracture almost. And that can take a couple weeks to show up on X-ray. Otherwise it can just be like a hard ball contusion. So as you can see, he's got his boot on. And I don't know if we fully told you guys everything that happened. I mean, you just saw that, you know, he got his x-ray. He went to the doctor. We did all this stuff. But we're going to let Zach tell you the story of exactly how this crazy thing happened. So tell us the story. Well, basically, every time it's lunchtime at our school, we play soccer. 
So we are and everyone loves playing with you guys. Yeah, everyone. Yes. Well, what's funny is before we came to school, no one played soccer. I asked my friend. Ever since we came, everyone plays soccer. So. Yeah, they love playing with Zach and Chris because they play club soccer, and everyone looks up to them because they're good players. Yeah. So it's usually like a seven on seven. We're playing, and one one time it was when it happened. There's this tree, and it was medium sized tree, and there's a layer of bricks around it, just like one little layer. It's kind of hard to see because it's like just one thin layer. But like um, a little retaining wall? Yeah, kind of. Yeah, like a garden bed retaining wall kind of thing, yes. yes. Um, so I was, someone kicked the ball and it bounced off someone, like their knee or something, and I was rolling towards the tree really fast. And the tree was near the other goal, so I was going to quickly kick it in the goal before it hit the tree. Because he thought he could save it because he's a good player. Yeah, I usually try really <laughs> hard to keep it in, and I'm used to running towards it and kicking it. But then, it, I guess I thought the bricks were further away than they really were, so that I kicked, I hit the bricks. He kicked the and, brick. Yeah, I kicked the brick. Full and, power, he yeah, said. Yeah, and there's some, uh, on the tree there was, there's shade from the tree, and people like to hang out there and like do Pokemon trades because there's shade. So there's these two girls from our class, and they said after they saw the whole thing, because they're like two feet away from it, and they said it sounded like two bricks hitting each other, because how hard it was, and then yeah, I just got ice, and it really hurt. Yeah, he said it hurt incredibly bad when yeah. he first kicked it. And he took off his shoe, right? Yeah, you look like, at your imagine foot. stubbing your toe. Most people think that hurts. Now imagine kicking it as hard as you can on a brick. <laughs> Speaking of people getting hurt, <laughs> Chloe just ran into the door. <laughs> anyway, so Zach said he took off his shoe, and then he got ice. Yeah. And then that's when they called us, and then they called us again. And here's where we are now today. So anyway, he has his boot. He's been wearing it. We have an indoor boot and an outdoor boot. Mm -hmm. So one he wears around and then one that he can wear to school out and about. Yeah, it turns out the doctor called the next day after the x-ray. Oh, after the same day. Yeah. And she said that it's probably just a deep bone contusion. We're crossing our fingers because there's a certain type of fracture that it still could be. But yeah, I think it's feeling a little better. So the chances are it's just a bone contusion. Yeah, you guys kind of heard the call. I don't know what you could really hear on that call because we got the call at the soccer game that night yeah. that he couldn't play and he hasn't played any soccer since. But yeah, we're just hoping that's the case because if it was broken, he would have had to have surgery if the bone was like moved. I guess that's like the only thing they could do is surgery, she was saying. And then if it's fractured, he'd be out for a little while. And then if, with this bruise, hopefully a month or less. Um, you know, based on the injury, because it's pretty swollen, it's pretty bruised, like visibly bruised. So, yeah. So that's the story of Zach, one of our well, actually our first kid to ever wear a boot. <laughs> we don't have a lot of injuries around here. We're David had a generally cast pretty on his safe. Foot one, so. Yeah, but David and Michael are the two that have gotten hurt. But overall, we've been a pretty like knock on wood safe family, safe and healthy family. Thank goodness. So anyway. Give Zach your, um, your well wishes, please, in the comments. And advice, I think he, he would love some advice. He's had some problems like sleeping and just random things like that, finding a shoe for the other foot and, you know. So I'm sure some of you guys have worn a boot. So leave us your advice. Tell us your stories. We would love to hear them. And hopefully we'll be updating you guys with good news for Zach very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.